The grieving partner of a farm worker killed in a blaze near Esperance has expressed her heartbreak over his death and anger at a lack of mobile phone coverage in the area. Leela Vadniel spoke to Michael Genovese earlier today. I'm sorry, there's no excuse for the loss of four lives. There's nothing you can say to excuse it. That's just ridiculous and it's, it's and he needs to own it. He needs to own it, man up and do something. A message to the Premier from the grieving partner of Tom Butcher. It's been five days since the farm worker was killed in bushfires that continue to ravage the Shire of Esperance. I've lost my partner, I've lost my horse that I had for 10 years. Um, his sisters have lost their brother. Um, and his parents have lost their only son. On Tuesday, the inferno reached the farming town of Scadden. Along with fellow workers Anna Winther and Julia Korslik, Butcher decided to flee, loading Leela's horse onto a float and unknowingly drove straight into the flames. I just have so much sorrow and so much heartbreak for so many people and for Anna, she was beautiful. And Kim's family, I didn't know him, but I just... It's upsetting. Leela says phone coverage in that area is next to nothing and Tom couldn't have known how close the flames were. Farmer Fred Kerno also perished in the blaze. He'd been driving to warn his neighbours about the imminent danger. Why didn't he call him? Obviously he had no reception. Obviously, no there's no other reason. People who live around Esperance have long been calling for better phone coverage. The area has made a national list of mobile black spots. Six months ago, the state and federal governments pledged $118 million to help fix regional mobile phone black spots. Nine new towers will be built here in Esperance and for the people caught up in these fires, they can't come soon enough. Mobile phone coverage in the area will be reviewed as part of the state government probe into the disaster. It's dense bush. What are they going to do? There's crap reception out here. There's people would, would be going onto the internet to try and find out information and... You can't. Michael Genovese, Nine News.